That clip, inspirational, I might add, from a new movie called The Boys in the Boat. Uh, good sports movie, but a lot more than just a sports movie. And um, I think you'll see that the, the theme, teamwork, is really important throughout. Uh, it's, a, it's a wonderful film, but it's more than just a sports movie and more than just teamwork. Yeah, it's a story about uh, being the underdog. Uh, here, take a look. Today, are you gonna make it? We rode out of need. Come on, boys! The need to stay in school, the need to eat, to sleep. We gotta keep these right as long as we stay on the team. Washington Huskies coach is bringing an inexperienced vote to the competition. They said we couldn't compete with the richest schools in the nation. The Washington boat has taken the lead! Washington has done it! I got nine seconds under the course record. Olympic year this year. Olympic year? I didn't realize. Yes, underdog and come from behind and teamwork wins the day. But as I said before, it's more than just a sports movie. It's a classic sports movie. I mean, I think this is going to rank up there with um, all the great sports movies that uh, people love over the years. But this also has the romance in it. And it's got uh, all the adversity that these uh, rowers have to go against. The, the University of Washington underdogs that they were actually made it to the Olympics. And it was the year was 1936. It was the year that Hitler and the Nazis were going to dominate. And Jesse Owens, of course, turned it all on their head. This is the story about another team on the U.S. Olympics who also turned the world on their head, the crew, the rowing team. Yeah, and uh, kind of interesting, it's directed by George Clooney, which made me assume before I knew anything more about the film that he would be in it because he did such a wonderful job disappearing into the role. So I thought he was going to be the coach because it wasn't. He was the director. By the way, acting was superb. Just get it out of the way. They uh, they did it. They did a great job. Uh, but what what really set the stage here, and as uh, John, as you say, it's a, it'll go down as a classic. It's going to go down as a classic like Rudy and uh, the, the guy who was the walk on for the Philadelphia Eagles. Yeah. And uh, many of these things, uh, the, the Jim Thorpe story, another Olympic-based uh, uh, thing from earlier years. Uh, Mark, about... what, was the, what was the classic movie about the Olympics with the, the runners? Da, 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 there was that. And it was better than that. Yeah, yeah. Right. We'll think, we'll think of it and we'll put it in the postscript someplace. But yes, <laughs> uh, chariots, chariots of the Fire. Chariots like of that. Fire, yes. Right. It, it, all I, I also think of uh, Robert Redford's The Natural as a great yeah, sports. Absolutely. Player. Hi. Just a quick interruption to ask you to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. This has all the elements beautifully directed, wonderfully acted. Really loved it. Right. And by, by the way, this is the kind of movie that I remember when I was young that was inspirational, like Audie, Audie Murphy movies. You talk about underdogs. Okay, yeah. uh, and people who weren't supposed to be able to make it, uh, it really doesn't matter. But this was a team in the Pacific Northwest, just sort of getting through the depression. Uh, many of the uh, uh, key uh, people there weren't making a whole lot of money or uh, ha had personal stories within the story right. of the team itself of this nondescript team in the Pacific Northwest going against the likes of, uh, I think, uh, Cal uh, Berkeley was uh, one of the leading thing, uh, or right. USC and other well-heeled teams. And every step of the way, every time they made it, another obstacle was thrown in their way. Yeah. And uh, they yeah. overcame it. And it's just, again, superbly acted, uh, well-directed. Uh, I just don't find any fault in this movie at all. Yeah, I think it's uh, I, I think it came out early in 24, mm -hmm. if I recall. I could be wrong about this. And it went into the theaters and now it's uh, streaming on uh, video. I think it's going to be eligible for an Academy Award. And yeah. I if it is, if I am correct about that, um, it will win. It will definitely win. Or certainly it will be a contender and it'll win 
some parts, of, if for no other reason than having captured the period. Because when yeah. we see this, even though most of us are did weren't of age by then, we weren't in our teens by the time the Depression was ending, it's the kind of stuff that we all grew up and we were sh shown about yeah. and uh, uh, people who were wearing rags and things and, and overcoming uh, uh, mighty hurdles. And this has all of that. Uh, so yeah. just, uh, uh, this is an Amazon Prime. Go take a look at it. It's included in your subscription fee. You will enjoy this. And if you don't, don't blame us. There's something wrong with you. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.